think we can break this down together. Sure, let me grab my pickaxe. Just trust me. Did you feel the way I tore the veil? Aye. I did. And we did it together. What did I do? You brought me focus. That's plenty. Can you do it again? Oh, I intend to. Need a stronger hand from your favorite ghost? Shall we? Strange place for a stockade. Farm ground. Marshy approaches. Mike Bannockburn. 1314. And the Scots beat the English. You won the battle, but who won the war? Dunno. It's not over yet. Do your new thing now! <laughs> What a hole. New England is well named. Is Scotland more pleasant? No. Scottish climate shite too. As is the food. And the music. It's an awful place. At least, that's what they tell you foreigners. Can I join in too? Dead are fitful and angry. Something hinders them, something bitter. Let me clear a path for you. That's a witch's work. Could it be Seeker? We cannot be sure. Tread carefully.
Something feels off. The veil is thin here. The dead are many. So, you dislike crows? Winged carrion eaters. They always bring despair. Maybe they just follow it. Can I tell my arse my elbow? You better take the lead. My thoughts exactly. Corpses. We could manifest what hides here. I summon you now. Can I join in too? Help if you need it. Not gonna ask for help? Follow my voice. 
Ready and waiting. I feel something close. Just me, you. I felt it too. Could you knock that gate down? There is no way I'm breaking this. Let's find something else then. Arrows. Local tribes. What the invaders left of them. Arrows. Local tribes. What the invaders left of them.
shelter if you need a fire to warm you up. This is locked from the inside. Did we miss a few? Trouble ahead. Shall we? Red, there is something wicked placed upon this. I can sense it. You can just sense it? It's hidden, even for me. But I can hear its dark will. Like a curse or a spell. A curse or a spell. Shite, that seeker. The witch. Seeker Red. 
The Banisher, who died for her novice. Ah, the witch's novice. Ho oh, there, Anthea. I've heard a lot about you. And I you. On my return, Ceridian told me our poor wee Banisher would turn up haunted. A haunted Banisher. Well, it is funny, isn't it? What was that thing you fought? Thing? Oh, him. He's a bloody nuisance is what he is. Are you badly hurt? I've tangled with old Mossad before. A couple of minutes to myself and I'll be fine. Ceridian knew about Antea's ghost. Obviously. Not very bright, is he? If she knew Antea was around, why did she not tell you to tell me? Ceridian withheld that information from both of us for a good reason. Better trust her plan. Death is a part of life, Banisher. You know this better than most. I suppose she didn't want to break your heart again. You tended to him. Thank you. Uh, oh, I'm a good novice. I do what I'm told. You look like you need a moment. Can we help? <laughs> Thought you'd never ask. Some of my spirit chasers went out. Uh, that's how old Saul crossed the hem. The hem? The hem. Where the fabric of the living world meets that of the dead. Ah, the veil between the visible and the invisible. Whatever soothes your soul, Vanisher. Rest, heal. Tell us how to fix the spirit chasers. The spell is cast. You need only light them. Be careful. Old Mossad won't have gone far. Oh, I'll sit down now. Good luck. Have fun. So, how do we do this? We light the spirit chases with flint and steel, I guess, I think. Useless. Relics of a colony I wager, long ago failed. Sight spread. <laughs> Troubles about. Fun. Watch out! Ha! 
Bless all. There, our first spirit chaser. He really doesn't like these things. This ivy is well rooted in the invisible. Time huh? is impossible to come out. Standing by. I feel something close. Need a little push to open up a path?
One more to go. Here's one more. This should be enough. There. Witchcraft is easy. I don't know what the fuss is about. I'm sure your witch friend would agree. I think I'll just tell her we're done. What was called up that spectre's arse? A lost battle? A betrayal? Cowardice in the ranks? Who knows? Need me to give that roadblock a little push? Seekers vanished. She does that. She's over there.
Did I see you talking to a crow just now? Yes and no. All ready to go then? Good. She's waiting for you. Go where? To see your mistress? Ceridian, yes. In a boat. It'll be fun. No, we're going to New Eden. The nightmare's grip on the world is too strong. The fog is too thick. You cannot enter its stronghold. There's no way back to the meeting house. Not yet. And not without help. We've done fine on our own so far. You're dead. Maybe you're not doing quite as well as you think. You're blunt, but I take your point. We'll talk to Ceridian before we move on. That's better. Follow me. Careful. Don't rock the bow. Have we far to go? How far is far? Don't worry. You'll be safe. Safe? The mire is home to many angry spirits. <laughs> but my mistress keeps them quiet. <clears throat> Dead quiet. That spectre you fought looked like a harvester. Vanishes and their labels. He'll surely be back. So will I. The veil seems thinner here. Always has been. We call them the Maya Marshes, but the nearby tribes call it the Ill Mouth. Stay too long, we'd get sick. Is that why Ceridian's wards wane faster than they should? That is because she is dying. I'm sorry. Life's a journey. Death is but one step. This is almost as lovely as that ride through Hedengracht. All we're missing is the hailstones and the Russia at our heels. I'm sure we can arrange something. You do plan the best escapes. This old soul. What does he want? Destruction. Bloodshed. Ceridian's head on a plate. They must have known each other once. We could help you banish him. You banishers are so arrogant. He's Ceridian's business. Best we don't interfere. What can you tell us about your mentor? I could tell you quite a lot, but I'm not going to. She's a very old witch who's tended this very big garden for a very long time. That's it? Believe me, that's more than enough. We've never faced this many spectres at once. Spectres are drawn to you two, like moths to the flame. Why us? Dunno. Feels like something powerful finds you interesting. Welcome to Ceridian's Island. There is much power here. Oh, you noticed that, did you? Like I say, welcome to Ceridian's Island. She's at home, and expecting you. 
Follow the path until you find a black pond near ancient ruins. I'll see you there soon enough. How does she do that? It's a trick, right? There's more to that one than tricks. The girl is gifted. If we want to stop before we met, this place will do. Hanging dolls. Witches do like to be creepy. As a child, I made dolls just like those. <laughs> I bet you did. Seeker's Black Pond. I can see why they call this the Ill Mouth. What is that? Antia? No, that's not quite true. I knew who I was, it's just... I was lost, and I had nowhere to go. I had no when to go. Does that make sense? Time lays traps for the dead. It's never fair. His voice was a beacon. The light in the darkness that led me back to me. And to the world. You have a powerful connection, you two. Or will have. Or had. Possibly all three. And here he is, the other banisher. Greetings. Good day. Come, sit. It's been too long. Have we met? Of course we have. Just now. Or so later. Decades ago. <laughs> Never mind. It's good to see you, Red McRae. I told her our story. I hope you don't mind. Such an ordeal. I'm so very sorry you have to go through it. How hard it must be for you both. I... thank you. But now you're here together, and I'm glad. Because you'll only be able to end this together. Why have we found so little native presence in New Eden? They have been here. But they have never settled. Wise men and women know that the region, the Maya marshes especially, are rotten. Is that why you settled here? Here, the hem is thin and frail, and the Maya rich in agitated spirits. 
it is also secluded and hard to find. Both excellent reasons to remain. Here we may hide away and mend the hem. Why have we found they wise men? Is that why you used here? The hem here. We must reclaim Antea's body. But Seeker tells us the meeting house can't be reached. The fog cannot be crossed. Seeker is right. The fog is the nightmare. The nightmare makes the fog, you mean? The fog is the nightmare. The nightmare is the fog. Each grows the other as their influence strengthens. It taints everyone all through New Eden. It clouds their minds and distorts their vision. But you have already cleared the dark woods. The work has begun. It must continue. Who are you exactly? Who is Seeker? We, Banisher, are witches. Aye, that much I knew. But why are you here? Why New Eden? Are you linked to the Nightmare's wrath? She has no grudge with us. We are caretakers, shepherds of the dead, keepers of the invisible. We are also scapegoats, a convenient place to put the blame for the world's ordinary evils. You brought us here. Why? You have many questions, and I have little time. Your novice mentioned it. I am sorry. <laughs> I am not. Soon I'll be one with the trees, root and bark. But that is not why I asked you here. Dearest, dearest, the path ahead is yet unclear. But know this. If you are to defeat the Nightmare, your hearts must be open. Open, of course, to each other. No barriers. Your bond must be strong. How can we defeat it? How can we even begin to match its power? You surrender. Unconditionally to each other. When you died, dear Antea, New Eden crumbled, but some yet live. Seek them out, help them. The nightmare won't like that. No, you are after all a threat to her existence. And rightly so. She believes you cannot reach into her domain. She is wrong. There is a way. The Void. A dreadful place beneath both the Incarnate and the Invisible. When you have learned to walk the Void, you may use it to enter the Nightmare's Den. First, you must free the people of New Eden from her grip. What is this void? If there's a place beneath the incarnate and the invisible, this is the first I've heard of it. Now you have, and not before time. That's enough for now. Is it safe? What will we find there? Who knows what you'll find? It ebbs and flows, expands and contracts, twists and turns, but you won't find safety. In the void, safe has no meaning. Just know this. The moment you enter it, you must escape. In places, the void is breached. 
Follow the beacons. Do not stray, and all will be well. Our seeker crafted you a tuning key. With it, you may open the breach. Don't linger. Time is fickle. By the beach as I drowned, you sent Seeker to find me. How did you know where to look? Are you asking an old hedge witch how she knows what goes on in her own garden? The woods and rivers are full of friendly claws, and feathers and scales. I always know what I need to know. I guess that's the best answer we can expect. It is the best of all those I've tried, dearest dears. The nightmare in the meeting house was by far the most powerful ghost I've ever faced. From where did it come? Unforgiving wrath is a bottomless well for vengeful spirits. But in this case, I suspect an even more vile source involved. What do you know of Deborah? Not much. I have avoided the people of New Eden for decades. I do know she was tried for witchcraft. Was she a witch? Was she one of yours? Would it matter if she was? She was no witch. She was a woman. A victim of the basest of human fears. We know the beast was linked to the nightmare. We're not so clear on how. Through the beast, the nightmare inflicted its curse upon the settlers. The beast was its avatar. I'm sure it has others. What are they, exactly? They are... manifestations of her power. They may also represent her only weakness. The Nightmare's spirit was shattered by the violence that created it. Properly studied, the pieces may provide the key to lifting her curse. We recently came across a cursed item and thought you could help us cleanse it. Really? Why us? Well, you know, spells, curses, witches. I was teasing. How fun it is to see you squirm. There are many ways to enchant an item or dispel its curse. Seeker may be of help. Go talk to her. She likes to tease you too. Thank you, Ceridian. We'll be off. Before you leave, tell me, what did you choose? What do you mean? Each of you made a promise to the other. What was it? What did you choose? I chose to stay. Lives for a life, an expensive bargain. I made a promise. I'll pay the price. I do not judge the deal. I worry about the cost. The tuning key is on the table. In the void, it will protect you. Seeker waits at the pool to show you the way. Funny looking spinning wheel. Do you weave with it? Of course. I weave essence, Red McGrath. Help yourself. Well, 
and take all the help you need. Witchery. Feels unnatural. Dangerous. Vanishing, of course, is famously safe. <laughs> 